Hello everyone, hello family. Thank you everyone, thank you for all your support. So this video is about the Kalalu. Um, this is all the ingredients I have for my Kalalu gravy. Um, this is beef meat. It looks like the beef stew meat is just fresh. I just bought it. And this is, I have a sour orange. I put it on it. This is what I'm gonna clean it with the sour orange, a little bit of vinegar, and I'm gonna put some salt to it. Yes, and if you don't have no sour orange, you can use lemon juice too. So I'm going to really rinse it out. There's nothing to take out because it is just clean. So I'm just going to rinse it out. So after I rinse, I rinse it, and I'm gonna put all my seasoning on it as you know i'm gonna use my haitian nippies this is two spoon i have of my haitian nippies this is the key of the food because this haitian nippies have all the seasoning on it and i have this goya package made with vegetables so i'm gonna use that one and i'm going to use the red one to the season because this um sauce in and I'm giving some colors so that's when I use this we continue seasoning and I'm going to put one spoon of sour orange juice on it if you have fresh sour orange you can put it or lemon you can put it too doesn't matter so now this is my color calling okra yes i'm gonna check it because some of them might be hard if it's hard i'm not gonna put it it got to be soft to break see when you press it you have to break if it's hard you don't use that you can save it to do something else but don't cook it because you cannot you're not gonna be able to eat it so now i clean up i take the bottom of the and top the cocoa off some people can just put it whole like this but no that's not what my mom um, used to do so I cut it I take it off and I rinse it out so now this is my meat I'm going to put I put a little bit like two tablespoon of oil I'm going to put the meat on it. Yeah, I'm just gonna add the meat. And I'm gonna mix it. And then I'm gonna let it cook. I'm gonna cover it and let it cook. So family, don't forget to tell me where you watch my video. Yeah, I add a little bit to water. I waste the bowl. And then I'm gonna let it cover it and let it cook. And you know how you want your meat. I want my meat to be soft. So now the, this is the tomato, the one tomato. You see I have that's the tomato. I take the seed inside of it. And then I put it with the meat. So I let the meat continue to cook. Because I want it as soft as possible. And, and I, go, I add some more water because it was not dry. It was not cooked. And then after the water dried, I let the meat steam a little bit and I add a little bit one cup one spoon of um, tomato paste not with really tomato sauce and I add a little bit more oil to it but it's up to you depending on how much oil I'm making this sauce for my husband so he's a very picky man so I got, I got to make make it the way he would like it not the way I want it if it's for me I will not use that much oil, but I got to make it the way he want it. And then this is um, crab. As you know, you already know how I clean my crab. And I seasoning my crab. And I squeeze a little bit lemon to it because I want, I don't want when I eat crab, I have to smell it, to smell the crab. As long as you step in the house and you smell the crab, no. And I squeeze a little one lemon to the water because you know you don't want your kalalu being slimy you don't want the okra being slimy so this um lamb gonna make it 
perfect it's not gonna let the okra be like a slimy like greasy so you don't want that so that's what i add the lemon and so now i put everything all the spicy i have i show you before thyme clove hot hot happen jalapeno pepper so i put everything in and now i add my crab yep i add my crab my seasoning crab very tasty and very clean but like i said not everybody cook the same way some people clean the crab take everything off but some don't but i use this is how i use i use to clean it so this is what i'm continuing to do and now this is my okra i check it yeah this is my okra well done and very tasteful so which i'm going to eat it with some white rice family don't forget to always share my video to your social media and uh, and like it please send me a comment because as i always said not everybody cook the same way let me know because you watch the video you see what's going on sometimes i might my may be making mistake and i don't even see so let me know family and don't forget like share and bring some more people my goal is reach 2k so let please support let me which help me to reach my goal family and look at this sauce look at this okra very tasty and i'm telling you this is what my husband he stick with me because he know i can feed him that's three things men want so as long you can feed him and you can take care of the kids and you can take care of the rest so you got him yeah this is the food the black beans white white rice and my okra it's white there yes this is this plate is for the king